Each year, we do a video covering the best web browsers overall. With artificial intelligence being integrated into almost everything these days, some people want to know which browsers are the best with AI features built in. So coming up, we'll show you the top five AI web browsers that can help you to be more productive in your daily life. Let's get started. First up, Arc Browser for Windows and Mac is from the startup company called The Browser Company. It's one of the first browsers to integrate artificial intelligence features. Some of you might recall, we recently did a review of Arc along with a short beginner's tutorial showcasing its features. For those of you that did not see it, I'll link to that video in the description. In that video, we did not cover the AI features, so here's a quick rundown of what it can do. With Arc Max enabled, you can ask the AI questions about the web page you're on to get clarifications and summaries. Hovering your cursor over any link in search gives you a preview of that web page. You can use ChatGPT in the command bar on Arc, just like you would on ChatGPT itself, getting quick answers to your questions in fewer steps. This feature does require that you have a ChatGPT account linked to your Arc profile to use it. Tidy tab titles will organize your sidebar using AI technologies from OpenAI. It organizes them into different categories while renaming them when you have them pinned with shorter, more concise titles. To enable Max on Arc to get the AI features, click on the Arc icon in the upper left corner and select Settings. Scroll down to where you see the Arc Max section. Click on Turn on Max. At this time, all of the AI features mentioned are available with the Mac version of Arc. Only a couple are available for Windows, with more coming soon. So make sure the box next to Automatically Enable Future Arc Max Features is checked. Next up is Microsoft Edge for Windows and Mac OS. As many of you know, Microsoft has been quickly integrating AI into many of their products and services. Their Edge browser was one of the first. Edge has a ton of AI-powered features built in, so I'll go through these quickly. Using Copilot in the sidebar on Edge lets you quickly get answers to questions and summarize web pages. To access Copilot in Edge, you'll find it in the upper right corner. You would just need to enter your prompt at the bottom of the sidebar. Moving on to the other features, wherever you write online, Compose helps you to create drafts of emails, documents, essays, and a whole lot more. Read aloud will read whatever's on your screen in your browser with natural sounding voices and accents and lets you adjust the auditory experience to your preferred pace and desired language. Text prediction can speed up the writing process with AI powered text predictions. This feature has been hit or miss for me, but should improve over time. Using their AI translation technology, Translate will instantly transform web pages into your preferred language with more than 70 languages to choose from and their image creator from Designer, powered by Dall-E from OpenAI, can help you to create AI images using a text prompt. The Brave browser, which is known to most for being one of the best privacy-focused browsers, has gotten into the AI game as well. In addition to macOS and Windows, it's the only browser in this video that has its AI features available for Linux users as well. Brave calls their AI assistant Brave Leo AI. It uses a few large language models for its queries, Claude from Anthropic, Mixtral, and Llama from Meta. These Brave hosted models are private as well. They do not retain your data and are not trained on your data. Leo AI can help you to summarize or get direct answers from web pages, PDFs, and documents. You can easily create your own emails, articles, and anything else where you need help writing on the web. To access Leo AI in Brave, just click its icon in the upper right, you can enter your prompt at the bottom of the sidebar. Clicking the icon on the left side of the text box gives you tools to explain, rewrite, change the tone, and other stuff. This will be a quick one. Sigma OS at this time is only available for Mac OS. A friend who uses it recommended that I mention it. He finds it to be very similar to the Arc browser, which I mentioned earlier. Sigma OS calls their AI companion Eris. I don't use a Mac, but thought it would be fair to at least mention it. From what I've been told, its AI features are similar to the others already mentioned. If you've used Eris, let us know in the comments your thoughts using it. 
not to be left out. The folks at Opera have their own AI assistant built into their browser for Windows and Mac OS. They call their AI assistant Aria. Also available from the right sidebar, it reminds me a lot of Copilot in Edge, so we won't spend much time on this. In short, Opera's Aria can summarize and answer questions from web pages, PDFs, and other documents. It can generate images. It has a read aloud feature they call AI text to speech. And when you upload an image, it can give you details about that image by asking questions in the text prompt. Thanks for watching. Links are in the description. If this video was useful for you, give it a thumbs up and share it with others. I'm curious what you think. Do you use AI tools in your daily life or are you cynical of AI? Let me know your thoughts in the comments. And if you're new to our channel, subscribe and click the bell to not miss out on our latest AI videos and other tech-related stuff.